What is going on guys? Welcome back to another video. My name is Ron and this is MotorTube. I hope you guys are all having a fantastic day. Today is a very special day because a friend of mine is taking delivery of his brand new, I'm not gonna say it just yet, but just stick around. You're gonna see it very, very soon. So the coolest part is the car he's actually trading in to get this other car. It's a pretty cool car and I didn't think he would trade it in, but we're about to go sit in the red eye right now because he is about to pull up and it is just too cold to be standing out here. All right, guys, and here he is. Let's turn the car off. Here's the car he's trading in. Look at that, that thing is crazy. Yes, and those are HREs. Yep, this is the electric Porsche. The Taycan, I believe. And I think it's wrapped. I like how the door handles come out. What's going on, brother? Man, this thing looks clean. Wow, looks nice. Is that the ride height? Or the air is up air, I pull it's, it in. it's air. Okay, so it goes up and down. I see. Let me pull, pull it down. Dude, those hey, those wheels are beautiful. Much more better, but there's air down. Yeah, yeah. So I noticed that it's sitting up a little higher. So now it's gonna go down. Yep. It will take time. Hold on. It will take. Uh, Second, because the car was not in the moving situation. Mm, I see. So it's I nice though. What's you'll see, you see it? What's making you trade this thing in? You got bored of it already? I got some charging issue. Okay, okay. So oh, charging. Okay. So charging issue is not that bad. It just like it will for real in the time consuming. Oh. Let's wow. say you're gonna do a trip, like let's say you're gonna come over here, like for mm -hmm. me it's an hour 20 minutes drive. Yeah. I have to leave my house like two hour 20 minutes ahead. Because you have to what, charge it? Yeah, I probably have to charge it. Oh, we got a Porsche right here. The owner, Saeed, is a Porsche guy. Oh uh, yeah, he loves Porsche, huh? One of the best driving cars out there. So, it's a house full of Porsches and then we got a boat here. But his new car is right behind those doors. So we got the keys right here, and I've never been inside one of these. Here's the cool part. So let's say you lock it, the door handles goes in, unlock it, pops out, then you open it. Look at this thing. All right, so. Oh, wow, so you got a screen right here. I think there's another screen right here. I don't even know how to turn this on, but we're gonna figure it out. I think you just, I don't know, this is, I don't know, I don't know, honestly, I don't know a f***ing thing about this car, this is literally a driving battery, I don't even know how to turn it on, maybe this is how you turn it on, I think it's on now, maybe not, let's just get out of here, we're embarrassing ourselves, this is a fail, complete fail, but we're just gonna get out now, so, it has these beautiful HRE wheels and the car is actually wrapped. It's wrapped in this like color changing. I don't know if you guys can see it. And then we got my big boat. And then we have a 911. We got more cars in there. So let's step in. Well, let's lock the car first. I don't want anybody stealing it. They probably won't figure out how to turn it on. We got a C8 right here. This thing is actually sweet. It has this beautiful white interior. Look at that. And then you got the blue seat belts. I like this. And you got a Porsche here. His owner loves Porsche, so there's a thousand of them here. You got a 570 here. Got a Huracan. It's like satin white. And then you got another R8. For 69,000, not bad. And then you got another Porsche. This thing is sweet. It's like got these red stripes. Look at that. That's the R. The R? Let's see how much it is. So is $350,000, wow. A pista. Oh, it's a Pista. Oh, yeah. I love this car. Look at this thing. Wow. 
Look at that air goes through right there. Comes out right there. The piece that's probably one of my favorite Ferraris. And then you have a Ford GT. But this thing, holy f Wow, look at the carbon fiber steering wheel. Leather, red stitching. Wow. This thing is badass. All right, guys, here is the new car. So he just bought this car, traded in the Porsche to get an R8. The main reason he said is the charging during the winter was taking way too long and he had enough of it. So now we're gonna hop in here and go for a little ride. I've actually drove one of these, but it's been a while so. very tiny and I just love the fact that everything is right there the GPS all the what made you get an RA I'm really curious what well, well, I why why did you get an RA obviously you went from a Porsche well, to an RA I was thinking the Porsche is gonna be losing value soon. losing value right this is already bottom bottom line in the market mm. so I'm not worried about losing it even I just talked to sites the owner, so he, oh, the yeah. owner. He said like, after a year, you put 10, 10 more thousand miles, and he's still gonna buy it back for probably like one fifteen. Oh, okay. So I only pay for one twenty for this car. So even after you drive ten thousand miles, and after a year, you only lose five. This car right here, he lost ten, and it's only been three months of ownership and only five thousand miles. Yep. And this one obviously sounds a lot better because you can't hear that one. What do you guys think? Should we get a supercar on the channel? I told you guys I'm in the market for a new car. Uh, I'm not gonna give you guys no hints, but do you think a supercar should be the next car we should get on the channel? This thing is badass. Um, if you guys didn't know, this is pretty similar to the Huracan. I think it is the same engine. Um, I heard also it's pretty much the same platform, except it's a uh, Audi. So, and you're not gonna pay 180, 174. One thing I'm curious about, does this have a front lift system? Nope, does not have. No front lift system, the Dang. Porsche does. Well, not really, it's Porsche. kind of the whole suspension that goes up, right? On the yep. Porsche? Porsche does have the suspension that go all the way. So this thing comes with what? How much, how many, how much horsepower? This is like oh, around like, the 580. Like the 580? Five, yeah. And, but it doesn't weigh much, so it weighs what, like 30? 500. 3,500? So is this your first supercar? I mean, uh, yeah, isn't it, this you, is a supercar, right? Yeah, consider it. It's considered a supercar because it's like the same as a Huracan. Yeah. Same motor. So. Is this your first supercar? Yes, it is kind of. First supercar. Yeah. Mid-engine, V10. V10, oh, you're about to hear that mother But We could change the driving modes, put it in the most aggressive mode. Uh, so dynamic is the most aggressive? Yep, dynamic. Dynamic individual auto and comfort. I just love that everything is right there. And I feel like it should be on every car because you shouldn't be looking anywhere else. Yeah, exactly. Like that's a huge screen. I know, it's a... Uh, it's huge. Really big screen. Yeah, I usually would complain that there is no screen mm -hmm. in here, but there's a big screen right there that controls everything. Also, I'm not even that tall, I can't extend my legs. Alright. Oh, there's another Porsche. Don't know too much about it yet, so kind of tried to get used to it, so, you know. I think you don't need to know much, you just put your foot on the gas and go. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that Porsche is nice, it's a, what is it, a 911. Oh, it's quick, it sounds just like a Lamborghini. It is a Lambo, I mean, it's, it a, is. it's a poor man Lambo. It's a poor, <laughs> ah. I mean, some people probably just prefer this yeah, over, over a Lambo. It's more cheaper, I would say. Right. 
Uh, what about driving? Have you uh, like experience? I'm mean, obviously. I drove the Huracan. It's kind of like the same. The same. This is more softer suspension, less mm -hmm. aggressive. Less, less. Yeah. Okay. So here's the cool part. You could hear everything back here because the engine is right there. Well, let's put my seatbelt on. Yeah, that's just, that's why it's beeping. I said, "Well, what?" Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with your car, bro. It's just uh, me not wearing my seatbelt. I, I thought it was it something like probably the check oil level. Yeah. Max. So we got carbon fiber here, carbon fiber here. Woo! This thing is quick. All right, we're back. All right, let's see how we're gonna hop out of here. We kind of just have to jump out of here. So here it is. Congrats to him. Audi R8. We got a GTR right here. This thing is beautiful. Wow. Look at the wheels on these. I think this is a new one. Yeah, it is a new one. They have different steering wheel. Interior is absolutely beautiful. Look how aggressive the new GTRs are. I believe it's a different front bumper, a few things that are different, and I just love on the GTRs that the brake calipers are right here. Usually most cars have them back here. They're on the front. But yeah, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I get so excited when other people buy new cars because as a car enthusiast, you love seeing other people win and seeing them in newer cars. Are you about to head out? Uh, I'm just waiting. He's, he's coming out? Okay. Yeah. So, like I said, I love doing taking delivery videos because I, I'm too broke to be buying anything. So I just let all my friends do all the buying and, you know, I like them enjoying their money because, again, Rich Dad won't pay for Audi R8. Maybe one day. So, <laughs> um, yeah, guys, uh, let me know what you guys think of the Audi R8. Um, I made a video on an Audi R8 before, so I don't think... We're gonna review this car or do anything crazy with it. He does have a Raptor that we're gonna get to and uh, make some videos with. He has a few bikes. He has he has a lot of cool toys. So stay tuned for the videos. But man, I love this Porsche. First time seeing it in person, and I fell in love with it. It is beautiful. Probably one of my favorite electric cars. I don't like electric cars, but this one is lit. Like just look at that. Little things like that. They put in details in this car and it made it look so good and I think this lights up right here the Porsche logo and the color is cool the color is cool obviously not as uh, aggressive and obnoxious as the red eye but it's still beautiful we have a BMW and then we have a 911 right there so it's time to let you guys go um, I'm still on the hunt for a new car again I'm not gonna really uh, hype it up I'm not gonna uh, make a bunch of videos of a hey, should I buy this should I buy that should I buy this so I'm actually just gonna drop the video of me getting a new one and that's it it's, we're gonna get straight to the point this time I'm not gonna hype it up and I'm not gonna waste your time I'm actually headed to Chicago today to go check out one of the cars I want to buy so we're gonna see how that goes stay tuned hopefully we can take delivery of this car you know within the next week or so but with that being said I hope you guys liked today's video if you did give it a big thumbs up if you're new to this channel smash the subscribe button turn your notification bell on to stay up to date with the videos and also check out the new merch link in the description and I will catch you guys on the next video I'm just hanging out with my ex today